How's it going everybody? This is Jack and this is Orkso 2.0. So if you're unaware, Orkso was a very, very popular city tweak for the previous iOS 6 jailbreak and it took sort of the uh, Cydia sort of community by storm and this is its uh, newer brother, just being released today pretty much and I think it looks very, very nice. It combines your multitasking and your control center all into one very nice package. As you can see here, it just runs absolutely flawlessly. You can do your volume up and down, your brightness up and down, just like you always used to be able to just with the standard control center. But it, it just all adds it all together. So I personally, I don't think this is quite as nice as the previous generation of Orkso. But obviously this is iOS 7, so it's a new generation of operating system entirely. So they have to make it look um, more like iOS 7. And by no means does it look bad. I just think uh, it could be ma maybe tweaked a little bit more, such as the amount of blur and some of the things could be just brought down. But yeah, all your toggles and everything like that. And as I said, by no means does this look bad at all. It looks very, very nice and almost Apple-esque, as I do say a lot in my tweak videos. So you get all of your con um, sort of functionality of Control Center. You can swipe up from the bottom as well, uh, just because it sort of replaces the Control Center. You can either double tap on your home button or swipe up from the bottom. Plus it works for other tweaks. So I've got Purge there and I just held down and deleted all my apps. So I can just actually swipe up from the left and you get sort of a quick multitasking, which is very, very useful. If you don't need all the toggles, you just need to swipe between your apps quickly. Swipe on the right and if you're inside an application, it actually takes you straight to the home screen. Not sure why I showed you like this, but if we just open up an application quickly, say if we open up settings, and I'll show you this option just here. Swipe up and it takes you right back to the home screen. Works very, very nicely and definitely a nice little feature they've included. So if we just take a look at the settings now for Orkso 2, and there are, uh, there's not a lot to configure, so you're not going to get confused with them all. You've got to sort of get two menus, so you get sort of your simple ones at the start here, which you can just configure them all. So if you actually don't want the control center within it, you can just delete that. But it looks pretty much the same as the standard uh, sort of multitasking, so I'm not sure why you want to do that. Uh, but you can also just sort of delete that quick multitasking on the side if you don't want that. So if we just take a look at sort of the, um, the more settings here, so you can actually have a sort of a minimal look on this. So it works okay uh, if you don't want your brightness or volume on there, and you just if you choose that for always, as you can see, you just get rid of that brightness, um, the sort of the volume slider and things like that. And it works okay, but I think it's just better to have them on there. And you get quite a few other options, which just really allow you to customize it how you like. And as I said, I'm sure Orkso will release a lot more uh, options in the future to make it your sort of even look any even better. So anyway, this has been Orkso 2. This has been sort of a brief video because there's not a lot to cover on it. Obviously, if you want an in-depth video, definitely check out I Download Blog as they obviously are sort of the leaders of making silly tweak videos. Anyway, this has just sort of been my take on it, and I really think it's a very, very nice tweak. I never really got to use Orkso all that much the first generation because it sort of came out and I wasn't really jailbroken all that much because of uh, previous updates and I actually accidentally updated and things like that. But anyway, this is Orkso 2. Definitely check it out. It is $3.99 in studio, which is on the pricey side, but I'm sort as you can see it is a very very in-depth tweak and as I said it does work with other tweaks such as uh, Polis it also works with which I haven't actually really used but now I see that it's compatible with it I'm definitely going to take a look at it and for that sort of 99 cents um, I believe it's cents <laughs> the sort of price point I'm definitely going to take a look at that and probably uh, even install it on my device because it looks very nice and it just it, it's the fact that they, all of these tweaks sort of just work in harmony with each other it's very very nice as I said Purge also works so you can delete all your apps at once anyway this is also 2 for iOS 7 if you've enjoyed this video and you're definitely and you're going to go and download Orkso 2, definitely leave a comment down below because I'm interested to see what you think about it. And thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time.